Monday. We are going wild here because everyone's favorite family is about to take us on an amazing adventure. The Irwin, they're back with an animal pack show. But before we talk to them, we're going to take a look at a clip from Crikey, it's the Irwins. We work together, live together. I love our animals and I love living here. We're all about carrying on in our dad's footsteps. And now you are going to be part of the Irwin family. Please welcome Terry, Mindy, and Robert Irwin, everybody. Thank you. Thank you, thank you guys for being here. And, and I heard you, you talk about your, your father there and your husband, of course, who is such a, a, a legendary figure. I mean, you know, in all of our lives. An we, inspirational. Inspiration. So how are you carrying on his legacy? Yeah, well, with, with everything that we're doing at Australia Zoo, with our new show, it's all about showing people how we are continuing his work. So at the zoo, it's the most hands-on facility in the world. I mean, you're getting right in close to every one of these animals. We also do conservation work with so many different creatures all over the world. So it's really helping people connect with wildlife and, and saving them in the wild and making sure that his message lives on. That's Plus it's pretty awesome to grow up in the in the it zoo. Is. I mean, it's we so live right fun. in the middle awesome. of Australia Zoo, so every day is new and different, and we're around all of our beautiful animals, and it's fantastic. It's not just what we do, it's who we are, and we love every second. And to be able to bring everybody on the journey with us is such a blessing, and we're so excited about it. So, yeah. right <laughs> part of it and that starts with education and information people have to know about these animals mm -hmm. to know what they need and what we can do to prolong the species so we're really excited to have you guys here and meet some of these animals thank you so terry you ready to bring some animals out yay <laughs> okay i'm gonna be honest with you i don't know if i'm gonna be here the whole time but <laughs> we'll see what we got yes, yeah, let's let's go. Go. So these little guys are actually baby Hello. porcupines. <laughs> now, baby the porcupines. little baby porcupines. Hello. Hi, baby. I absolutely love oh. their names. We've got Quilly Nelson, we've got Quill Smith, and Little Quill as well. So <laughs> how, how, old, how old are they? These guys are two months old, so when they're full grown, they're going to be like 40 pounds of porcupine. Oh. And they're from Africa, so you can see this can one's really, it? she's really, really grumpy. Oh, don't <laughs> oh yeah, you're going to say that. So, and I'm over there. So, yeah. <laughs> so you can see those quills on the back end, and what she'll do if a predator's coming towards her, she'll fan those quills out, and then she just wields that back end so nothing can bite her, yeah. and then she stays safe. It's so amazing. they live about 15 years in captivity, about half that in the wild, but they're beautiful animals. They're not meat eaters, so they just eat a lot of vegetation. They have really um, fantastic, sharp teeth. Oh, little they, little they, quill, be good. Got a great haircut as well. It looks like they've got a good mohawk yeah, going on Yeah, it does, there. <laughs> totally. Okay, what do we have next? We okay. have some all other right. very cute animals. Look, go. we're all in khaki today because go. khaki's not just a color, <laughs> it's an attitude. So okay. we're all in our khaki, khaki today. Attitude. We've yeah. got our khaki crew, so we have... You, you know, the other nice thing is when, with these porcupines, people <laughs> think megafauna, so they want to protect rhinos and elephants. Yeah. And then by doing that, you also protect these cute little animals That's as cool. well. So yeah. Everything yeah, gets protection. Really yeah. And you kind of forget about, you know, you know it's not the, the mighty porcupine. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> the mighty porcupine. Crikey, it's a snake! <laughs> Yay! Well done. Hey, yeah. So, this little one here, this is actually an albino reticulated python. Yeah. So, they're an amazing snake. They're from Southeast Asia. They're beautiful. Yeah, and you can see this isn't actually the usual colour for one. See that yellow coloration there? That's because it is an albino snake. Usually they have this amazing kind of mottled brown colour. W would you like to, to give her a pat? She's, she's, you're welcome you to, to yeah. Yeah. You're welcome to give her a pat. A lot of they're people... Really, oh, they're nice Michael. and smooth. Yeah, yeah. a lot this of people really think that... You're moving the way you move. You're fine, you're fine. Don't, don't do anything sudden. You'll be you're fine, good. you'll be all good. But what's good. interesting is a lot of people think that... Wow. People think that snakes are sticky and slimy, but snakes actually can't sweat. So they're always very smooth and cool. Mm. to the touch. And so these guys have hundreds yeah. of very long, sharp, curved yeah. teeth well, because they're constrictors. They have teeth. Yeah. Really yeah. Awesome. yeah. So they're... Um, yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. And a 
I will say, it is, that is beautiful. Oh, it's good. really yeah. beautiful. They yeah. really are. And, and what's amazing is that a lot of people think, you know, snakes are intimidating, which is okay. <laughs> it's nothing to worry about. But for a snake, <laughs> actually, people are more scary to snakes. <laughs> because if you think about it, if this little guy was sitting on the ground, he'd only be about that tall. Yeah. So people look a whole lot bigger, which is why there's this big misconception that these guys can be kind of aggressive. They're just trying to defend themselves because humans look so large. Exactly. But so they can be really grow. sweet. To be the largest, can, longest snake on the planet. Yeah. They'll, yeah. they'll get up in over 25 feet really long. Really long. So he's and, still quite uh, small. They, they would yeah. be able to eat something bindi size. So. Totally. So yeah. that's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we are going to keep him through the commercial so you can get a little better feel for the snake, Michael. We did that for you. <laughs> well done. Okay. The Irwin's new show, Crikey, It's the Irwin's, airs October 28th on Animal Planet. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.